What's up travelers? In this video, we're gonna let Gordon Ramsay cook for us. So stick around and check it out. Alright, so we are at Gordon Ramsay Bar and Grill Mayfair here in London, and I am so excited to be here. I mean, you get to eat some of Gordon Ramsay's recipes. I mean, what, what the deal? I don't know if he's here or not, but you know, his spirit is at least. <laughs> Scott Dell, I just, I just sat down and ordered a 10 ounce ribeye. It's 39 pounds for the ribeye, and of course it doesn't come with any extras. So I got a, a house steak sauce on the side, which was another two pounds. And then I got mac and cheese with creme fraiche and crispy bacon. That was another six pounds. And then I got a mixed leaf salad with quinoa and a citrus dressing. That was another five pounds. And I am just so excited for it. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I spent a lot of money on this meal, but how often do you get a chance to go eat one of Gordon Ramsay's restaurants, you know what I mean? Oh, would you look at this steak? Oh my lord. So I just talked with the chef. So this steak, it has been dry aged at least 40 days, but up to 55 days, I don't know for sure. When they cooked it, they coated it with a brown butter with thyme in it and basil. And then the sauces that came with it, uh, they're made in house. This one here is a ground mustard sauce. So you know what, I think we're going to go ahead and try that before we try anything, just a little taster. Oh wow, I've never had anything like that before in my life. That, 
has, it's got a really great mustard flavor to it, but it's not like overwhelming. It's, it's uh, really nice and chunky, like the it's like fresh from the sea. It's absolutely fantastic. We are waiting on our side still, but let's get into this steak because this thing, it just is screaming for some love. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay doesn't love me. <laughs> oh my word. Mm. Mm. Wow. Oh man. Oh wow. So that just exploded in my mouth. Like, juices just went everywhere. And the flavors. <laughs> I'm telling you, the, that first bite alone was worth the 39 pounds that we paid for it. I'm thinking it would almost be a crime to put any of the sauces on us. But we're going to have to try it anyway. Alright, so let's go ahead here. So we just got our mac, our sides, our mac and cheese, and our salad. But we gotta try this steak with some of the sauce here. You do not understand how good that is. That sauce, it actually complements it. Usually sauce is there to, to kind of take over. But no, it just takes that flavor from the steak and it expands it. Oh man, what a deal, man. I can't believe I'm eating this steak. I cannot believe that I am eating this steak. All right, so now, I guess we gotta try some with this mustard sauce. A little bit of mustard there, right on this bite. Man, there's so many different flavors. Unbelievable. We got some of the other stuff here too, so let's give that a little bit of love too. Go ahead and jump on into this mac and cheese. Uh, like I said, I talked to the chef here, and this mac and cheese, it's three cheeses. He didn't say what cheeses were in it, but it's also got some crispy bacon, buttered breadcrumbs on top, and then they finished it with some truffle oil. <laughs> and, oh, and you just break the crust there, and Look at that cheese bowl. <laughs> oh. Am I dreaming right now? I swear. Oh yeah, there was a couple of smoke oils in there that they use as well. Mm. Yeah, this some cheesy, smoky, bacon. Crunchy, soft, they're just, how do they do it? I don't understand. Mm. Wow is all I can say. So far, we're two for two. We are just nailing it here. Let's go ahead and try some of this salad. So we got some. Some green salad here, some, some leeks, some tomatoes, some onion. And the chef said that they finish it with a honey citrus dressing. And we'll just look at that. This is the only way that you can eat the salad. 
Wow. <laughs> it's rare when you find a salad that just is every bit as good as your gourmet steak. <laughs> but we found it. Mm. I'm so glad I came here. I think needless to say, you have to get a reservation when you come here. Wow, this is so good. It's fantastic. Unbelievable. Speechless. Yeah, how good this food is. I am absolutely speechless. I guess what I'm trying to say is there is a reason why Gordon Ramsay is the most famous chef on the planet. And uh, I didn't know what that reason was until about five minutes ago. <laughs> I am so excited to understand why now. <laughs> oh man. If, if you're ever in London, you, you have to come here. He's got a couple different restaurants here. I'm not, I think he frequents them all and he cooks at all of them. I'm not 100% sure. Mm. 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 I wanted to get the beef wellington, but it's for multiple people and uh, it's almost 100 pounds <laughs> just in itself. Probably would have been worth it, but this steak, this is the best steak I've had in my life. It includes the steak Florentine I had in Florence. The dressing in that salad, second to none. I could have that salad dressing in my house. I would eat no other salad dressing. I'm telling you. Please like this video, subscribe, hit that notification bell so whenever I upload a new video, you get to know first amongst everybody. As always, eat great food. <laughs> Thank you, Gordon Ramsay. <laughs>